so it's Melissa from Kiwi Banana and got up at quarter to five this morning, had a shower, made some smoothies to take along with me today because I'm going along with a bunch of like-minded people who are going to be doing a kind of like a demonstration out at a lake, a location should I say where people like to shoot ducks for sport as they call it so So you would have seen some footage of a demonstration or us on the way of our demonstration and in the city, just outside the city shall I say, where I live and I guess I'll just do a quick rundown of what happened and why would we be doing it. So the demonstration for that day, I don't know if you would say it wasn't successful or that it was successful. We didn't come across many duck shooters, to be honest, and uh, we're unsure of why that is. It could be a very, should I say, there could be a range of options, uh, things to do with weather. Maybe they prefer to come out on a Saturday morning and a Sunday morning. Possibly there was something else on that they were more interested in being involved in. Involved? Evolved. Involved in. So we did come across um, some sounds of gunshots and we tried our best to get to wherever they were. However, the area of the lake that they were on can only be accessed through private land and so we're, uh, we were unable to reach them. We did find a lot of areas where there was ducks but of course you don't want to make a lot of noise and disturb them when they're in the water and they're not in the air so it was just best to just leave them as they were. Uh, the previous demonstration that this organisation organised, organisation organised, okie dokie, was a few weeks ago and that was quite successful shall I say and there was some media, they did invite the media along and uh, there was definitely some disruption. So I guess now you're just wondering well why would we involve ourselves with something like this? The thing is, a duck shooting is... It's inhumane, basically. Taking a life of another being, there's no humane way to do it whatsoever, but in particular with duck shooting, quite often they're not actually killed in the air. They may be injured or brought to near death in the air and then they fly down, well they fall down um, into the water and they'll get mauled by their dogs if they have dogs or they'll decide to you know, go pick them up and then uh, you may not want to listen to this part but I mean that's the honest truth, then they'll generally um, pick them up and just sort of spin their heads around so that they break and that generally kills them. Not always. Uh, I was talking with a hunter the other day who actually, they prefer to hunt other animals and they call, they agree that duck hunting was worse than, than hunting, than, uh, the hunting that they do. So I don't know that that's not necessarily a good thing or a bad thing. Um, but yeah, so they would, even they would just agree that that's, that's quite, quite inhumane. And of course, of course, some of the duck shooters in New Zealand, actually probably all the duck shooters in New Zealand, will use the excuse of that they're feeding their family. And all I would say to that is, well, you need to get a vegetable patch. And, oh, well, we're trying to conserve certain species of uh, plants and other ducks and other wildlife by killing these animals. And then I would probably say that they need to look into the fact that there's actually other conservation methods that can be used where the ducks aren't actually killed. Yeah, they might want to look into the whole maybe disrupting the fertility of the ducks. I know it's not maybe as cost effective as, uh, as what they're doing right now. But yeah, 
that's what I would say. And like obviously the, the whole conservation issue is a video I could do a top like a whole spurl on another day. So yeah, that's basically it. Um, we were out there trying to scare the ducks away from the lake if there were duck shooters there trying to shoot them. The ducks that we did find, they weren't being shot at, so we were quite happy to leave them there. Of course, there is other, you know, animal activist issues that we, well, that, sorry, that, that organisation does target, and it's not just, you know, the small minorities of duck shooting. And There is other, obviously, animal agriculture is the biggest thing that um, most animal activists want to target because that's where the most of the animals are being killed every day to, all around the world. But, you know, yeah. So that's just basically my little bit of involvement um, with the duck demonstration. And, you know, just letting you guys know that I do involve myself with, a, not I wouldn't say a lot, but I do involve myself with the odd real-life animal activism. You know, it's not just me here on a camera online or just on something like Facebook just telling people to do this and do that. I do try to involve myself in the local um, animal activist slash vegan community and in my city and I would encourage you to do so as well if you have the, the confidence to do so and um, obviously with the duck demonstration it's not safe you know you always run the risk of someone shooting at you because they're like why the fuck would, are you here um, you're an asshole <laughs> well that's what they think I'm sure in their mind so yeah and I mean, I'm not always going to be filming what I'm doing here in the local community and, um, you know, and sometimes it's stuff I do in the community will not necessarily be something like that. I mean, I'm really open to volunteering for other organisations that might just hand out pamphlets and do other sort of things like that. Like, I am, I am all for helping all sorts of actions and whether they're online or offline, I don't mind. Obviously, I try to fit in my university schedule and um, my work so I can pay my rent. And um, yeah, try and fit this in all at the same time. Yeah, I want to be more involved. I want to do more. You always want to do more. And um, and yeah, I will take you along the ride for any, some more. And I'm sure, you know, you're not always going to see everything I do. And um, yeah, that's it. That's this video. This is why I don't agree with duck shooting. Well, in the short, you know, a short sort of blurb. That there's no point going into philosophy and other sort of science about it because uh, we can get more in discussion on that if you really want in the comments down below, or you can make a video and reply. That's no problem. And I hope you've done something that makes you happy today. See ya.